guys, it's me Madeline and today I'm going to be doing a swimsuit try on haul. Zaffle.com had sent me some swimsuits to try out for you guys and make a YouTube video of it. Okay, so I just want to put a quick disclaimer out there. I do not want to see any comments commenting on my body, good or bad. You guys, we are all perfect in our own ways. I am finally becoming really comfortable in my body and that's the only reason why I'm doing this video. I'm not doing this video to show off my body like I feel like a bunch of people are going to comment and I don't want people to feel bad about their bodies. We are all perfect in our own way. You just got to learn to love yourself. We all come in different shapes and sizes and I just hope you know that you are beautiful just the way you are. Don't compare yourself to my body and I'm not going to compare myself to your body and I just say let's all be happy and look at the swimsuits because that's the main part of this video so you can see some cheap swimsuits and if they're good or bad. <laughs> First I'm going to be showing you guys the swimsuits that I am absolutely in love with and then I'm going to go into the swimsuits that just didn't really work out for me and I will explain why? The first one that I am in love with is definitely this one. It's the little jean bottoms with this red top. I love this swimsuit and I could definitely see me wearing this for like a 4th of July type theme party. It is really good quality. I don't feel like it's going to break on me or anything. One thing that I am kind of like iffy about is that the bottoms kind of look like a diaper. <laughs> it kind of feels like I'm wearing a diaper. I don't know, but I really love the way that it hugs my waist. Basically, all the swimsuits had come with like the little lining inside, you know, the sanitary hygienic lining which obviously I took them out to film the video. The next one that I really, really liked was this one piece, and I just love these colors. Oh my gosh, these colors are so gorgeous. The back had a really cool cross pattern. It took me forever to figure out how to put this on. The front has a little ruffle with a line through the front. Yo, this makes these chesticles look great. <laughs> That's all I gotta say. But it is so pretty and it really hugs on. It has like elastic band so it can really stretch to your size. I don't typically go for one pieces but this is really freaking cute and really sold me on one pieces. I'm such an awkward height. I'm 5'2 so swimsuits either look so weird on me when they're one pieces but I feel like this one looks really nice on me. All right, the next one that I really liked is this one. And again, it took me forever to figure out how to put this on. Zaffle, I noticed that they really liked the strap designs in the back. I don't know. It's really hard to show. This is what it looks like. It has a little peekaboo hole thing in the middle that I really liked. And this right here, you can scrunch up to the size of your breasts. <laughs> so I really thought that was really neat and it's just really freaking cute. See, I got this all messed up. These straps are so confusing. I literally have no idea what's going on right here. And then the bottoms, I love bottoms that have the little tie strings on the side because you can adjust it to the size. Zaffle also has a lot of swimsuits that are very cheeky. So if you like cheeky swimsuits, that is the website to go to. I personally like to be kind of conservative, so it's really weird that I'm even doing this video. I normally go for swimsuits that are solid. I don't normally go for patterns, so this is really cute. I guess this was a mess up on Zaffle's part, but they had sent me two of these. So I'm not very sure why. But I have a second one, so if something ever happens to this one, I got this one too. <laughs> the next one that I really, really liked was this striped swimsuit. And I think I just really like stripes. I'm obsessed with them. But the one thing that I have to say is it's really restricting. I couldn't lift up my arms or anything. So I feel like this is more of a swimsuit for Instagram or taking really cute pictures in. I wouldn't say it's really a swimsuit to swim in which I guess you would really want to swim so you can swim in. But there's also girls like me that don't swim, but want to take cute pictures in bikinis, so. It also came with straps, and it just does the little, you hook on to the front. <laughs> this is so difficult. You hook up on the front, and then you tie it in the back, which I think would be really cute. I didn't put them on there whenever I was trying them on, which I kind of wish I did, because the more I looked at it on the video, it was kind of falling down on me, and I could tell that it was kind of lifting up at the bottom. So I wish I would have gave myself a little bit more support to hold up these girls. 
<laughs> it's nice quality again I don't feel like it's gonna break on me all right so another one that I really liked was this one piece right here it's just a really cool pattern I like this star design in the middle I just don't really know what this is I don't know if that's supposed to be on there or what. I mean, I feel like it would still look cute without it on. I have no idea. I don't know what this is. But it is really nice. It flatters me. I like the way it's like high-waisted in the back. And I feel like the top part is a little too small for me. I feel like I was going to have some under boobage falling out. But other than that... Oh, wait. It's kind of breaking right here. Oh, wait, no. It's like that on both sides. That's kind of weird. Um, right here it has like a little bit of um, breaking, but that's something to keep in mind. It is kind of breaking right there. Um, but other than that, this swimsuit's really cute. I love the way that it looks in the back, and I like the high-waisted. It's just a really cute swimsuit. How many times can I say really cute, and how many different words can I name my boobs? <laughs> I was trying to think of a different word that I've like haven't used yet. All right, so now we are moving into swimsuits that didn't really work out for me. This is kind of like a uh, half and half. <laughs> so the bottoms were really, really cute. I love the bottoms on this swimsuit. It's so cute. And I love the little straps in the back. And it just fit me really nice. And I just love this pattern. I keep saying love, 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 love. But the thing with the top was it was a little too big on me. I had some cup area, so it didn't really fit me on that level, and it didn't push up or anything. I think the reason why is because it has this little clasp thing, not to mention the clasp took me forever to figure out. I can't even figure it out now. It's so hard. I hate the clasp on this. I saw a lot of people just cutting this off and tying it themselves, which I think that is a really good idea because that's kind of why it was too big on me was because the bottom part that you tie around was not tight enough. Other than that, the pattern is really cute and it was just a size issue on why it didn't fit me. The quality seems really nice. One thing that I would test out though is in the shower or something, see if this white material is to see through. Sometimes when white gets wet, it will become see through. So you don't want that. I would probably test that out in the shower or something just to make sure. Another one that was half and half, I liked the bottoms. Really freaking cute. These are so adorable. I could just wear these with a plain black top, a plain white top. I could wear these with a red top. I could wear these with anything. I just love black and white. They have these nice little strappy design thing on the side like this on your waist. The thing about this swimsuit was the top was again a little bit too big. I had some cup area and I just felt like it wasn't really supporting me at all. But other than that, it was really cute. I wish it fit because I love the strap design on the side. The swimsuit is still really nice quality, I can tell, but it just didn't fit me on the size. Okay, so now we are moving into swimsuits that didn't really fit me or did not work at all. So this one, the bottoms were too big. I just felt like it wasn't really hugging me in the right places. can't really see the... There we go. Now you can see. I really love this line design right here, but... It didn't really fit me. This top, I have no idea on how this could fit anybody. I guess if you're flat chested, maybe. I don't know. Like, I just don't get this at all. And I just feel like the top does not look, like, expensive at all. It looks, like, really cheaply made. I don't know. I just did not like it at all. <laughs> like, at all. This one just did not fit. But it is a really cute design, and I wish it did. I hate the top. I feel like if the front was different, I would still love the stripes in the back, and I would love it with these bottoms, but the top is a no-go. <laughs> All right, so this one I debated whether or not I should put in a video because it is so see-through. Honestly, it just feels cheaply made. I do not like this one at all. I am sorry, I just don't like this one at all. It just feels like, I don't know, it does not feel like a swimsuit. I think that's why I don't like it. It literally feels like a stretchy shirt. It does not feel like a swimsuit. I hate it. It's really soft, but not a swimsuit material. I feel like if you got this wet, bro, everything is coming out. I really like, again, the stripe design on the side. It's really cute, but it is so see-through. There's no way I could wear this. Like, I can already see through it without it being wet. And the top just does not fit at all. It was way too big. Again, I hate the clasp. It's like plastic. I just feel like I could rip this in half. <laughs> 
These ones I could not put in the video. There's no way, no way, no way, no way. They were way too small for me, but I'm so sad because these designs are so cute. I will insert in a picture of what they're supposed to look like. Well, I'm so sad, but it was way too small for me. You could see the black, which I wish they would have done like a red on red, so that wouldn't be very noticeable, but they put a black underlining type thing and you could just see it and it just didn't look nice or anything. Again, the bottoms were way too small, way, way, way too small, and I would never feel comfortable enough wearing these out in public. But if you love cheeky bottoms, I say go for it. If you don't really have much uh, cleavage, you could probably cover that up as well. And which I think is kind of nice is I know a lot of people don't like padding, which you can remove the padding, so I think that's kind of cool. I didn't notice that on any of the others except for this one. And the last one to talk about is this one. The bottoms are really cute. I like this strappy design. I really, I guess I went for those when I was looking at swimsuits. Um, again, it's really cheeky though. I wouldn't feel very comfortable wearing these exactly why I did not put it in the video. But here's like the little lining thing that I was talking about. They had a bunch of these hygienic liners. But the main reason why this is last is because when I was putting it on, it broke. It literally broke on me. So I would not recommend this one. Wait, how does it go? Okay, yeah, it goes through here, like it just broke. I don't know, I was putting it on. I could probably easily fix it, but if it broke once just putting it on, imagine like being in the water. I like the design of it, it's really cute. It just did not meet up to the expectations. Again, it's kind of that like really thin material though, like that white one. I still really like the pattern, but it broke on me, so I would definitely not trust it in the water. <laughs> and I also wanted to point out that when Zaffle was sending me these packages, they came in five different packages on five different days. So I always hear a lot of people saying that Zaffle is a scam and you don't receive all the items that you paid for. I would wait a couple days to see if packages come in later because that's kind of what happened to me was obviously, like I said, five packages came in five different days. So I could see you freaking out on the first package, like where's this swimsuit or where's this swimsuit or where's this shirt, where's this pants, like whatever. Because Zaffle isn't just swimsuits, it's also a bunch of other clothing. I did end up receiving all the swimsuits that I purchased, but I also got some extra ones. <laughs> I don't know why. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, don't forget to give it a like, and comment down below if you want more try-on hauls. I go shopping quite often, so if you guys want to see more outfits of mine, I mainly go to like Play-Dohs and stuff like that. It's kind of like a thrift store for trendy items, so if you guys want to see that, let me know, and I would love to do a video of it. Yeah, I think that's all I got to say. Don't forget to follow all my social medias. They will be all linked down below. They're all AX Madeline. So I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Do you see my service? Oh. Are they laughing at? It's like whatever, you know. I won't ever see these people ever again. Hashtag vlogger's life. <laughs>